Hi, I'm Bob. Today, let's discuss sample selection and how to use data to alleviate sample selection problems. The endogenous sample selection arises when the sample used in the model is not representative of the population of interest. An example is to estimate the wage offer function in neighbor economics. For people who are in the labor force, we observed the wage offer, but for those who are out of the labor force, we do not have the wage data. Because the labor force participation choice may be correlated with the unobserved factors that affect wage offer. Using only the working people in the model may cause bias. We will learn status Hetman selection. We will also do the two-step sample selection correction manually and compare the results with OLS. The status extended linear regression command also provide an option for sample selection. We use a fictional dataset. There are 2,000 women in the dataset. Among them, 1,343 worked and earned wages. First, we run an OLS regression. We regress hourly wage on education and age. We store the result with the name model OLS. Next, we use sample selection correction to take into account the women who are outside the labor force. We use the command Hetman followed by the wage equation and the option select. Inside the parenthesis, we write down the variables that determine whether the dependent variable is observed. The option two-step specifies that we are using Hackman's two-step estimator. We also store the result with the name model sample selection. Let's compare the results from sample selection correction model and the OLS model by using the command estimates table. The estimates for the coefficients are different after we accounting for sample selection bias. And the selection variable, the inverse mu ratio lambda is significant. Next, let's do the Hammond's two-step manually. We generate the labor force participation choice, a dummy variable for the selection equation. In the first step, we run a probit model. We regress the labor force participation choice on the variables that determine this choice. and obtain the predicted value. Then compute the inverse mu ratio lambda. In the second step, using only the selected sample, run the regression of wage on education age and lambda. Save the result with the name model menu.
the estimates from the menu payments to step are the same as using Hetman command. Alternatively, we could use the extended linear regression command eRegress to fit the model with sample selection. Inside the parentheses, we write down the selection equation. The results are almost identical to Hackman 2 step.